this new program, Electronic Visit Verification, they're wanting us as caregivers to call a certain number and put in a personal identification number that they've got, I've gotten to my client, and then enter certain digits at the end of the shift of what I've done and punch out again, effectively eliminating the timesheet that the client would sign. The concept is good to call in and to call again when you're done because you don't have a supervisor with you and it's a way of ensuring you're there when you say you're there. The biggest problem with this electronic visitation verification that I have personally is the Department of Social Services is insisting that my personal identification number be five digits of my own social security number to be my personal identification number that I enter in every time I punch in, which is calling this phone number, and every time I punch out. They do not fill out the paychecks. Companions and Homemakers does. And they are not my bank and don't handle my money, so why should they need my social security number? It's an invasion of my privacy and I don't like it.